With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello. The problem states that a string is clamped at both the ends, and it is vibrating in its fourth harmonic. The equation of the stationary wave form is given by y is 0.3 sine of 0.157x plus cos of 200 pi t. So we have to find the length of the string is for and all the quantities are in the SI units. So let's understand the situation. If this is the string which is vibrating in its fourth harmonic and it is fixed uh, at two ends. So what do we mean by the fourth harmonic? The total number of loops which uh, the are formed here are formed are four. Okay, so here total four loops are formed. So this is how a string must be vibrating. All right. Now we are given with the equation of the standing wave, which is y is point three sine of 0.157 x cos of 200 pi t and then we can compare this equation with the standard equation of standing wave which is y is equals to 2a sine kx of cos omega t right so now we can see that the value of k which is 2 pi by lambda is given to us as 0.157 and from here we can find the value of lambda as well so lambda value would be 2 pi pi is 3.14 divided by 0.157 so that would become 2 into 20 which is 40 meter right so this is what the wavelength is now as we had to find the total length of the string so as we can see how many wavelengths are there so this is what the one wavelength and this is the another wavelength so the total length of the string will be equal to 2 lambda and the value of lambda we found it to be 40 meters so total length will become 2 into 40 which is 80 meter and this is given to us in the option b Right. I hope this helps you with the answer. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.